We also need to understand the identity of the church. Again in verse 18, Jesus said, My church, I will build my church. See, we have an identity problem in churches today. Christ founded the church. Christ died for the church. Christ is coming back for the church. It's His church. Not mine, not yours, not anyone's. But His. It's the Lord's church. How dare we try to redefine the purpose of the church when Christ has already given us the only mission, the only purpose we need till He returns. The Great Commission is our mission and it's our purpose. We are empowered by Him, by, through the Holy Spirit, to fulfill it because of the blood of Jesus. Ephesians chapter 3, verses 8 and following. To me, who am less than the least... This is Paul, folks. The Apostle Paul who gave us most of the New Testament. To me, who am less than the least of all the saints, this grace was given, that I should preach among the Gentiles the unsearchable riches of Christ and to make all see what is the fellowship of the mystery which from the beginning of the ages has been hidden in God who created all things through Jesus Christ to the intent that now the manifold wisdom of God might be made known by the church to the principalities and powers in the heavenly places according to the eternal purpose which he accomplished in Christ Jesus our Lord in whom we have boldness and access with confidence through faith in him. Therefore I ask that you do not lose heart at my tribulations for you, which is your glory. Folks, this is the purpose of the church. Imagine what God can do through a church when we see Paul's purpose as our purpose. 